There's a tract of land in, in central India um, which is inhabited by the tribal communities, indigenous people, uh, below which uh, lies mineral wealth. Uh, mineral wealth which is useful for the aluminum industry, the steel and the coal industries. The people who live above this land are the tribals and they are not the ones who gain from this mineral wealth below and therein lies the problem. The persons who profit from this mineral wealth are the uh, companies, the mining companies and the financial capital which exists in the US and the UK. There are a number of very progressive laws enacted in India, at least on paper. In reality, these laws are uh, not implemented. They are more implemented in the breach. Uh, for example, there are laws to protect the forest lands and the tribal communities and their lands. Uh, there is a Forest Rights Act, which was enacted in 2006, and there is an act which is called PISA, which is uh, extending the uh, local governance system to these areas, which is a much older act. But the fact that the tribal communities need to be consulted there need to be village meetings and resolution coming from the tribal communities saying that they're willing to give this land to the mining companies is never ever done. And even if it, when, if it is done, it, they often forge documents. So uh, ultimately, while you have these progressive laws, uh, the, the communities which they are who are supposed to benefit do not benefit from them. The policy lessons that come out of this is if the uh, progressive laws that exist in India could be implemented in spirit, the tribal communities and the uh, ecology of the community of the area could be protected. The second is that if we had a more holistic approach to understanding the costs and benefits of the, of the projects which are being implemented, the mining projects, the extractive industries which are being implemented there, you are able to measure both the costs and the ecological and human costs, the benefits from it and the costs from it. If you are able to see this in a more holistic fashion, you would be able to, you would do less damage to the ecology and the, and the community that lives there.